morning everybody, Will here, and today we're playing Don't Starve. I nabbed this game for the Nintendo Switch. It comes with Shipwreck and uh, uh, Reign of Giants, I believe. So I'm really excited to play this. I, I have it on my phone, I've played it on PC, but now we have it for the Nintendo Switch. And I'm <laughs> really excited for that. So, we're going to go ahead and get this on, guys. If you are enjoying my channel, drop a like and a subscribe. It's greatly appreciated. It does help me out. Tons, like you have no idea. It's so hard to start a channel in 2021, especially a gaming channel, nonetheless. But here we go. Uh, we are going to do a new game, and uh, I, <clears throat> I think this is where you enable the different. I don't know. I guess we're going to we're going to do Reign of Giants. I guess we'll do Reign of Giants. Would you like to make this world compatible shipwrecked? Yes. Uh, can we? Do we have unlockable characters? No, we do not. Hold up a minute. Who's this? The Cryptic Founder. Wagstaff. I don't... You see, I don't know if I'm familiar with Wagstaff. It has been about two or three years since I last played Don't Starve. A great inventor, nearsighted, and delicate stomach. Yeah, that might be a problem. We're just going to go ahead with our boy Winston. Oh, Wilson. <laughs> no. <laughs> Man, I'm already messing up. Okay. Okay. Anywho, uh, we're going to go ahead and get this started, guys. I'm going to play as Wilson. It is early in the morning. Forgive my mix-up. Uh, it's, I literally, you know, it's like, what, 7, 7.35? My girlfriend just left for school. She started, uh, she started up again. Summer's over. She's going back to teaching little kids, guys. So, wish her luck. But anyways, we're going to go to play as Wilson. This is going to be really fun. I'm really excited. Uh, we're not going to alter the world any bit. We're just going to go to get this adventure started. Uh, notice Reign of Giants enabled. Don't Starve Reign of Giants is an expansion geared towards experienced Don't Starve players. You can disable the expansion when starting a new game. Do you can do you want to continue with Reign of Giants enabled? Adventure. Sweet ass, I do. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear my cat in the background. Uh, I'm recording this in the office where I record these videos and where I work from home and uh, she's like meowing and pawing at the door she's like daddy let me in daddy I just want to be with you daddy oh, that's so good coffee is the best way to start the day guys <clears throat> all right how long is it going to take to generate the world? Well, I have some experience with this game. I can't say I've actually completed it, per se. You know, getting to Maxwell's portal. Uh, I don't even think I've unlocked all the characters. But, um, you know, we'll, we'll see how this goes. We'll see how this goes. Uh, this will be part one of this Let's Play series. So, let's see how far we can take it. that sound in the background that eerie like there's a live action adaptation for don't starve it's got to be directed by tim burton right we're all in agreement with that this world is very tim burton-esque oh there's maxwell he <laughs> better find something to eat before night comes Okay, so this is the world of Don't Starve. Uh, I, I believe this the, the actual name for this world is the Constant. Wait, hold on. Hey. Butterflies have a small chance to drop butter. Now nah, I'm going to waste time trying to kill that butterfly. I believe the actual name for this world that we're stuck in uh, is the Constant. Uh, I could be wrong. I'm not a... I'm not a I haven't read a lot about, you know, Don't Starve lore. Ooh, seeds and but uh yeah and we were tricked well us wilson there's a story there's a plot there's a story right there 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 is something and uh we you know wilson were tricked into creating that device that maxwell had us make and we were sucked into the constant as well as all the other characters right i think in don't starve together you learn their backstories but, uh, you know, this isn't Don't Starve Together. This is just the first Don't Starve with the Reign of Giants expansion. Okay, so, so far we have some uh, grass. Five sticks. Uh, we need flint. 
sometimes there's flint laying around. Not seeing any though. Maybe out of luck. Uh, I need flint. Flintstones. Oh yeah, Flintstones. Y'all remember those Flintstone vitamins? Like you remember being a kid, having your your mama, your daddy, bringing you some of those Flintstones vitamins? I remember. Uh, I kind of remember the taste, I suppose. Are they still a thing? Like, if you go to a store, can you still buy the Flintstones vitamins? Is that a carrot? <gasps> That's carrot. Oh, you know I'm going to get in on that carrot action. <laughs> now, what is this here? What is this? A collapsed rabbit hole. Oh, that was... The kingdom of the bunny men is closed for the season. <laughs> I love Wilson, man. He is great. You know what else is interesting? All the sounds that the Don't Starve characters make is it's a musical instrument. And it's they're all different. Now, I'm not a composition. I'm not a It's getting late already. It's raining? This sucks! Oh my god. We this isn't a good start. <laughs> I haven't found any flints. Uh, there's like grass and you know there's there's saplings and sticks and stuff. But in regards to making tools, I don't actually have anything. I haven't come across any flints. Okay. Oh, there's some right there. I gotta get in on that flint action before nighttime comes. Uh, speaking of nighttime, when do the hounds come? I know at some point, or at least as far as I can remember fucking eons ago, uh, the hounds start to come. Now, when does that happen? <laughs> oh man, we'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I'm going to continue gathering resources because that's a big part of this game is you can't have too many, too many resources at all. And uh, it's, it's definitely important to keep your insanity up. You can pick flowers to raise your insanity, craft items, devices. Is that a touchstone? <gasps> we already found a touchstone. Okay, so that means if we die, we'll just spawn back here. That is perfect. Alright, so I guess that's we, we kind of got off to a bad start, but in a way, finding that touchstone was a blessing in disguise. And we can also smash the the pig heads on the, on the sticks for uh, you know, pigskin. And we may be able to make a pigskin helmet. You know, the football helmet? I think that's what it's called. Alright, uh, we are going to make an axe. Because we... We can... Okay, we can roast these birch nuts. Two, three, four, five. And uh, we can roast these birch nuts. And if we get wood, we can make a fire when nighttime comes. Oh. Which is... You know, that's definitely what we want to do. Yeah, it's, it's about survival. And thankfully, the rain stopped. Here we go. Let's gather some wood, lads. I can't do that. No, pick up the... Wilson! <laughs> pick, pick it up! Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Got it. Okay, sweet. All right, let's gather some more wood. You want to chop down the, uh, the biggest trees. Now, be warned. When chopping trees down, there is a small percentage. You'll spawn a uh, tree guardian. Those bad mamma jammas, you know. But, uh, it's rare. It's, it's a low percentage. I'm not worried about it right now. I'm worried about gathering resources. That's what I'm worried about. I'm worried about surviving. I'm worried about don't starving. Let's eat some butterfly wings. It was cut down in the prime of its life. Now I'm going to eat it. Okay, now I don't have the flint to make a pickaxe. But I feel like there's going to be some around here. No. These are pawns. Little frogs jump out of those. If I remember. Well, uh, this could be good. This could be bad. Um. Okay, I need to make a pickaxe. Because those stones would come in handy. Oh, it's already... Oh, no. Oh. Oh, dear lord. Uh, uh, fire! Oh, thank God. Okay, I made it like just in time. Let's add some fuel. Actually, let's let's uh, we're gonna eat the berries. Nom, 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 nom. 
We're gonna... Each one is a tiny mystery. I'm gonna... I'm gonna cook the seeds. I don't know if there's any changes in the, uh, the nourishment you get from the seeds when you cook them, but... We're gonna keep the carrots like this and the birch nuts. Um, actually, I'm sorry, little evergreens, but... Oh, there's a... One of those teleportation holes over there. Uh, Excuse me. Oh man, I'm gassy. Uh, you know what? Last night my my girlfriend and I were watching Iron Man 2. We were watching the Marvel movies in chronological order, and last night we were watching Iron Man 2. And uh, you know that scene where he takes down that one painting, that, or you know that one uh, portrait that Pepper is like, no, no, you can't take that down, and he takes it down to put the little Iron Man portrait up. She's like talking about wind farms, and he's like, "Don't talk about wind wind farms. I'm already feeling gassy." Like, oh man, dude, <laughs> these Marvel films. Tony has to be one of the best Marvel characters, and they definitely did a great job picking Robert Downey Jr. to play him. I see that hole over there. Can I? A wormhole. That's what it's called. I was gonna say teleportation hole thingy, but it's a wormhole. That makes sense. Uh, it's been about 13 minutes. So, I guess we can cut this off here. So this was day one. Alright guys, well this was day one. Uh, we didn't really do much. We kind of started off on a bad foot with the rainfall and all that. But we were able to find a, uh, a touchstone. Uh, we, we have proper resources now. And we're next to a wormhole. So it looks like things might be taking a 180. And we're looking uh, at a better, better creek you know but all right guys i'll let you go um if you enjoy this content drop a like and a subscribe it's greatly appreciated i'll see you on the next part and until then have a wonderful day